This is Isla Borders and you're watching the iBaseball channel. Well, there's ebbs and flows to the game. Yeah. So, you know, there there are ways the game is played over the course of the last 20 years that have changed. As we sit here today, the game's kind of gone back from the power game to the speed game, right? So that changes the way you play it, the way you manage it, the way you coach it, because of the evolving aspects of the game. You know, teams are not sitting around waiting for the three run homer anymore. Just not happening. Uh, there's there's more emphasis on defense uh, because balls aren't flying out of the park as much. Uh, there's emphasis on stealing bases and to get in scoring position, uh, and certainly an emphasis on pitching because that's you know that's going to keep you in games. I, I'm part of a staff now that is in a division where you know we outside of Colorado we go to San Francisco or San Diego or LA and it seems like it's two to one every night. So the, all the, the, the emphasis on pitching and defense is certainly there now. Am I blue saying this, but the, are the, out, the outfielders now, they, they can't throw. The, 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 yeah, it's, it's so stuttered. It's okay. You can it's, do that often. But, I mean, is it something that they're... Is it because they don't work at it? But they're, no. I mean, clubs are recognizing, obviously, and they try to do something about it. But yeah. I, for me, I, I, I can't believe what I'm seeing sometimes. Well, I mean, I think it's part of the game and it's part of the clubs that win have that yeah. um, you but know don't you look at it to try to see like well is it uh, really where they're coming from back as far back as little league and high school they just flat not getting it you know nobody takes infield anymore what what happened to the get you know get them on get them over get them in thing small the teams ball. are built these days that you know everybody has their role right. so but you're, not you're everyone you're, your four hitter doesn't bump. Uh, BB wasn't the four hitter. Bremen made, made me bump. He does, not because he hasn't done it, because I'm telling you, he and, I came, he and I came up in the Reds organization, and they didn't give a rat's ass who you were. You're bunting. You're learning how to run the bases. You will hit the cutoff, man. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I mean, they were that. they, that's the way they did it on the field. Yeah. And so that is, it's a little bit different. You know, they just, it's, a, it's a little bit different. Yeah, they get... But they get groomed for a, a, a. But the game is the game, right? The right, game is sure. still the game, and the teams that do it. You look at look at the Giants, the teams that do it when they, they execute defensively, and they give themselves themselves a chance to to stay hit. in the game. Their pitchers can hit, they can bunt, <laughs> they can they can do all those things. But those are the teams that win. Why not practice it? Why not be a weapon? Just because you're a pitcher in the National yeah. League doesn't mean that you're it an outsider. It's amazing to me how clubs, like just like any other business, they overlook stuff. They they're mm -hmm. incompetent in some areas. They neglect certain areas, mm -hmm. and then they come in last or second to last. Yeah. Is there not enough time to get stuff done? No, before there's, there's still the same amount. There's plenty of time. You just have to have the commitment to do it. But you said the compression of the of the game. Compression the as far as infield right. goes. Right. So the you know the the home club. If we're on the road, the home club. Pushes their in their BP back as far as it possibly can. They give us the the time in between that and the game. Yeah. And sometimes you've got you know 20, 25 minutes before the, the game starts from the end of your batting practice. There's just no time to take oh. infield. It's not like it was back in the oh, day where really like, push when up. there was some time that we could take 10 minutes and take infield. Yeah. It doesn't. That's not the case anymore. I realized very early that I was going to struggle at the plate because I was it, it was way too early for me to be in the big leagues but the way I could help the team was play good defense so I concentrated on it so when these guys went out to pitch I needed to know they needed to know from me that I wasn't going to take the bat out to the field I, and if somebody hit me a grounder I was going to pick it up and throw them out because that was the only thing I really did well at first um, wasn't fast didn't steal bases you know, uh, so I could play defense, though. But, you know, I find myself, you know, in Dodger Stadium opening day or in my first game and facing Oral Hershiser, and I'm going, I got to catch the baseball. Just, <laughs> just catch the they ball. better catch the ball. Just catch it. <laughs> Don't worry about hitting it right now. Just catch it. Just catch it. So that's, that's, so it's, it's a sense of pride. 
And it's probably the piece of the game that guys don't work as hard on when they should. Because ultimately, as we've just seen, you know, the team that plays the best defense and pitches wins. Bottom line. 